Hello again everybody and welcome back to Fujits Blitz. Now, I'm generally a very positive person in my demeanour. I generally look at the glass being half full rather than half empty. And I like this game. In fact, I absolutely love this game. I think this game is just beautiful and perfect for me, the individual, in the, world, in the things I like. But, and it's a huge but... I've been playing the game recently. I do a lot of streams and all that sort of stuff. And it suddenly dawned on me, has Blitz lost its edge? Has it lost its ability to be fun? And that's a crucial thing because as a game, the, the, the whole idea of a game is to entertain you, let you escape from reality for a short period of time, Put all the woes of the world behind you, let off a little bit of steam, and have fun. Do we, or does Blitz, still have the ability to give us what we expect from a game, i.e. fun and entertainment? And that's a really tricky question. Um, you know, I've always said that Blitz as a game will give you a multitude of emotions, normally in one game. You can go from elation, massive giggles and smiles on your face, to absolute downright frustration, annoyance, anger, and, you know, total frustration, whatever you want to call it. And Blitz has that ability to do that. And sometimes it's within your control. Sometimes it's because you play like a Muppet, and sometimes you just make bad mistakes. But, and here's the crux, where is the fun when you yourself have teams that are clearly clueless? And, and I mean clueless, and I don't mean that in a nasty way. I mean, I went out in a battle um, earlier whereby they were clearly clueless, and it was tier 10. And, you know, every single player except two of us had less than 2,000 barrels in a tier 10. And they've gone out and they bought their Chieftain Mark VI or whatever other premium tank happened to be in the store at that particular time. And they think they can play the darn thing. And they can't. And it's a whitewash. And they don't know what they're doing. And everything's just not fun and dandy. Then you go out and you just get abuse. I mean, in the next video that you're going to see, in the next replay, we just get abused by a guy in a Kampfwagen 70. And the irony is... You know, he is absolutely dead set on he knew better than everybody else. You know, and aside from the fact that his maths is a bit questionable, you know, all he does is want to report us and he calls us names and everything. And the guy had less than a thousand battles. And, um, you know, he, he clearly just has issues. And this is the thing, I mean, what makes Blitz entertaining because sometimes it's just not sometimes it's one of those things that you just want to throw out the window and you you question firstly people's mental attitude because it is a very toxic game the people who play this game seem to be well you know very angry people and they i, I don't know what they're like in real life but if the the attitude in the game is anything to go by They've got issues. And I get that, you know, probably a lot of them are kids. I understand that. And I understand the way that kids work. I mean, I've got a child myself. And he's a toxic little BS when he wants to be. But the fact of the matter is, you know, screaming and shouting in the, in the sanctuary of your own home at an iPad or whatever you play on is one thing. Writing that stuff in a chat is something completely different. And what compels people to act that way when you're meant to be having fun? Now, I understand you could be just having a bad day. I understand you could be on a losing streak and all that sort of stuff. But if that's the case, turn the game off. Go away, grab a cup of tea or something and come back later. Maybe you'll get better with MM. Who knows? But I still question, have we got to the point where Blitz has ceased to be fun? And it's an important thing to ponder because once a game stops being fun and stops being entertaining, we've got a serious problem because people are not going to want to play it and people are going to leave. And if people don't play it and people leave, 
then the game will eventually die. It's that straightforward. And I think that the majority of the issues lie not with RNG, not with MM, but with the pure fact that players nowadays have firstly been given the the tools to rush through those tiers, what with boosters and gold and everything being thrown at you. But also, there's no desire anymore for anybody to grind a tank. Everybody wants the big guns. Everybody wants to get to tier 10. It's like, you know, I don't know many games whereby you buy it and you can jump straight to the top boss at the end. That you can do that in Blitz. And everybody seems how bent on doing that. And something needs to be done. Because if something isn't done, the player base will degenerate. And it will degenerate to such a point that players will leave eventually. Because nobody likes playing a game where you're going to be abused. Nobody likes playing a game where you're just going to keep losing and losing and losing. And recently I've seen majority of the players on my teams have got less than 45% win rates. Now I'll start saying 45% win rate players are useless. They're not. But that means you're losing more games than you're winning. Which means it can't be fun for you. Where is the fun in that? Anyway, something I wanted to ponder and I'd love to hear your views on this. Is Blitz losing its ability to be fun and entertaining? Let me know. And by the way, I mean, if you're the guy in the Camp 70, you need to chill out a bit more, mate. Because we almost carried your backside in that game. And you abusing us, um, you abusing players who are playing better than you, really doesn't help. And, you know, you've got a less than a thousand battles. So get a bit of understanding before you come back. Anyway, I've been Fujit. That has been a question that I just want to put out there. And I'd love to know your thoughts and views on this. Anyway, until the next time, stay safe out there. Try to have fun on the battlefield and try to have some happy tanking. Because that's what it's all about, really. Trying to have fun and trying to be happy.